I mean, when I started, I never thought that I would be able to uh, really get a grasp on it. And now I really feel like I'm getting used to it. I can understand most of the terminology, and yeah, it does make me feel very good. We administer the patient with a radioactive uh, pharmaceutical, and then we take pictures of the radioactivity and where it's gone. To be honest with you, I can't remember my first day. It was just, there was so much going on, so much information to take in. And I think the first week was probably a blur. I did want to go to university, but I felt like I couldn't afford to. Marshalls in Cambridge is a, has an airport, and I um, went through their recruitment um, services to become an aerospace engineer. I thought when I started that it would be a very sort of like problem-solving job, but really what it was was you were told what to do, and then you had to make the part and fix it. My dad's a mechanic, so he was extremely impressed that I got an engineering job. Um, and for me to uh, kind of jack that in to become a delivery driver, he was less than impressed, I'll, I'll be honest. I felt quite low about myself, and I felt like I could do more, so I really wanted to push myself. So I um, just happened to look back over what I'd been doing at, at sixth form and found the nuclear medicine job trainee on the Adam Brooks website. So I applied, not really believing that I would get it. I thought it was a bit of a long shot. Went to the interview and then got offered the job a week later. The most important thing about work to me is to do something worthwhile, to help people um, and to use your brain, you know, challenge yourself.